So the first part of the problem, we're looking for a conversion factor between kilometers per hour and miles per hour. So let's start with kilometers per hour and then figure out what we'd have to do, what we'd have to multiply to turn this into miles per hour. And this is pretty simple because the time a unit, hours, is the same in both parts. So we're just really converting from kilometers into miles. And so if you look it up, then you know that 0 0.621 miles corresponds to one kilometer. So put this into a calculator. The kilometers cancel out and are replaced with miles. And this gives us, I mean, obviously, it gives us 0 0.621 miles per hour. So not even a calculator necessary because it's just a number times one. But what this tells us is that 0 0.61 miles per hour is equivalent to one kilometer per hour. And so that is our conversion factor for part A. Now let's move on to part B, which is also fairly simple. We're starting with one meter per second, and we're converting to feet per second. Again, the time unit is the same, it's seconds in both cases, so we're really just looking for a conversion between meters and feet. And again, something you might want to look up is that 3.28 feet corresponds to one meter. The meters cancel out, get replaced with feet, and we're left with 3.28 feet per second. So our conversion factor in this case is that 3.28 feet per second is equivalent to one meter per second. So that's our conversion factor for part B. Lastly, we move on to part C, where we're looking for a conversion factor between one kilometer per hour and meters per second. This time things get a little tricky because now we're converting both time and length because we got to convert from kilometers into meters and also from hours into seconds. So let's start with the length because one kilometer is equal to 1,000 meters. So we're canceling out the kilometer in the numerator and replacing it with meters. So we put 1,000 meters in the numerator and put one kilometer in the denominator. Now for the time. We have hours in the denominator, and we want to cancel that out. Since we're replacing hours with another unit of time, this time we're actually putting, this time the thing that we're canceling out actually goes in the numerator, because whatever goes in the numerator is going to cancel out whatever's in the denominator. And one hour, as you can look up, or just do the math, is equal to 3600 seconds. So if you put this into a calculator, we get zero. 0.278 meters per second. So 0 0.278 is our conversion factor, or 0 0.278 meters per second is equivalent to one kilometer per hour. And that is our conversion rate. That's it for this problem. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing or donating to my Patreon, as that'll help me out in making more videos just like this. If you have a request or a question, leave a comment down below, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Bye-bye.